Hello, fellow gamers. It is Ice the Player, and welcome back to uh, Digimon World 1 with Tiling 95, who doesn't have a last name. I'm hiding. The gunmen are coming. The gunmen are coming. Hi. They are 100% coming. Shalmon, you saved me! So it was you. Okay, <laughs> I just wanted to have a deep ass voice. Mm -hmm. This is perfect. Oh my god. So, I was headed towards the city to help you, and then you fucking trapped me, you piece of shit. Oh my god. I'm ready to go to city. Is she really going to be useful? How do you know that's a she? Because the name is Shielmon? Oh, it's a she shells. She shells. She oh, fuck. Yeah, but they like, just like I just did, they completely slurred it, so it's like she shells, she shells. I'm gonna give you a storm wind. So you shit yourself faster. <laughs> And then we're going to autopilot the fuck out of here. I'll basically have a shit ton of video files now that I need to just, like, cut in pieces. <laughs> but no, but no, um, I'm reminiscing about your video files, so go take a shit <laughs> before it's too late. Oh my god, what the f what day is it for Gururumon? Day nine. He should evolve or die in like a max like three days. Oh, I thought they lived for like 15. Yeah, but like at day 10 or so, they start evolving into ultimates. Oh, okay. So, uh, we can train a little bit because now we have, we've accomplished quite a bit. We've taken care of Agramon there, here, beyond yonder. And we also just have to wait on your Pokemon. Unless yeah. you want to venture into the free slimps. Hey, look at that, brains. I'm a zombie. Look at that. Brains. Sorry, I just wanted, I just wanted to reiterate the joke. Aqu Whoa, we learned Aqua Mawa. <laughs> what the fuck? Ma. Ma. Uh, A-W, I think. But, like, yeah, the programming just like, Mawa. It's not going to be Ma, is Aqua it? Magic. Ma Wait. Where did W come from? Mawa. <laughs> Mawa. What the fuck does Aqua Magic do? Well, it has zero power, but 36 uh, anything. So I'm guessing it's some sort of buff move? 36 anything is really my favorite pain of all time. Go to sleep. Oh, you're also hungry? I'm gonna slap you with this giant meat. I like how you almost fed him the, um, the autopilot. <laughs> That's right, we're going home. We're not eating. <laughs> we're not eating until you go home. Oh my god, why is this so stupid funny to that's me? That's my phone. You have Let's a just mute that, because that's a 100... Oh god, they're coming, Sam. <laughs> I know, I was gonna say, <laughs> they know. They know now who you are. I've 100% said your last name before in videos. <laughs> Multiple times. But nobody, yeah, definitely. The, nobody will know, they can't scrub nobody the Nobody cares. Nobody cares. We care so little, we stop talking. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I'm just like very, I'm just like very sneakily trying to... Eat? Uh, that just defend the action we just got, right? Yeah, I'm just very sneakily trying to eat, um, like corn chips? No, not corn chips. Uh, puffed corn? Uh, what we got is the moderate ability, so he uses his least expensive MP move. Well, that's what, okay. Yeah. I wasn't aware of that. I always assumed that was just him, like, keep a distance and don't attack as often. No, there's actually a move called distance where he does that. And then there's, uh... An attack? <laughs> no, it's just another command you can give. Okay. And then there's, uh, defensive, which your Digimon doesn't move and just kind of blocks every attack thrown at it. Okay, yeah, defensive's the one I was thinking of, then. So that's, uh, that allows you to kind of just stall the game a little bit. Yeah, and then, finally, you get the ability to, like, manually choose between the moves. Yeah. Because I remember always seeing in the manual that there were, like, all those, like, long command lists, and I was like, I want to do that. I'm <laughs> just never going to Evident happen. Ev evidently never even getting the brains of my Digimon to even 100. <laughs> you know what? I think it's just a the law for now that until we have a champion, we're not touching brains. <laughs> 
We're not doing it. It's never happening. Wait, we're not touching brains at all. Oh. No. Also, also, I've just looked at all the videos and like the idea of how much we recorded, and I'm like, people will see the first part like I don't know, like in a week, and then the, the, and then it, this this video is gonna go up in like 2025. Like because that. they'll still be watching it because they're really laughing so hard they'll have to pause it. Absolutely, people will be like, "This is the funniest stuff I've ever seen." Like, have you watched <laughs> them? Like, they really think they're funny. <laughs> I said funny, not sad. Hi, <laughs> but it's funny when I'm sad. For twelve years, right? Like, and it's so weird because I feel like we're always like stilted and we're always trying to let uh, too hard, and then when we turn the fucking recording off, it's like we're. We just die. So, stop it. Just stop. Who the fuck are you? He's eating his fucking puff chips, I swear to God. Yeah, I am. He's fucking eating. What an unprofessional bastard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've been going for three hours. Sir, Jesus. Yeah, I'm fucking hungry too. That's why I'm like, I, I can't. Oh. <laughs> I was actually like, hesitant to start this recording because I was like, food. <laughs> the part where we all, where we don't want to do this anymore. What? The audience is going to think this is lovely to watch. Digimon World? You think we don't want to do Digimon World? This is a great game. I'm literally, when we're done recording, I'm going to eat and then I'm going to keep playing Digimon Cyber Sleuth and Digimon World Next Order. I'm good with these games forever. Yeah, I'm going to continue my own save file. <laughs> I was going to say. It's one of the reasons why I wasn't sure if I wanted to do this immediately. Just because out of, like, I want you to kind of have the magic. So I didn't want to, like, <laughs> show you everything, you know? But now we're here. Hey, yeah, you haven't really done anything yet that, like, I haven't done before. I'm going to kill my Digimon right now, get a virus, and go into the castle. <laughs> That's right, I got Ogremon. No! Now let's go. Not Ogremon. Oh no, you just hard commits to like the Sukumon. Oh yeah, fucking do that. No, Numemon. Because Sukumon actually have to fucking fill the virus gauge, which I don't want to see poopy all over the fucking screen. Poopy everywhere. Wow, this is still not open. Oh, actually, we need to beat we need to beat yep. Mommy Mom before we do that. Yep. Before we can open the west side of the map. We need to fucking wait for him to get done digging. It's biting us in the ass, the fact that we didn't check on him earlier. It is, it is, really is, and also the fact that we're not gonna sit here and do this shit. It's his job! He's getting paid for it. By who? Dramogamon, it is your job to drill the sun. Yo, who the fuck are the union workers here? Like why? You, know, you are... just you just said that, and like my brain immediately was like, yeah, these guys are in the union. Yeah, one hundred percent. Who the fuck? Oh, oh, oh! Oh, they did it. We did it. Yeah. And all we I had to do was shovel one cart. Time to lose instantly. No, shoot! We hit a big rock. I can't. That's a big rock. You can't. Oh no! We gotta Push figure it out. Aside. How... <laughs> Move past it. It looks no. It just looks like it's just a drop. So just like move the rock to the side. Why does your name not look right there? I don't know. Like it's lacking an N or something. That was a joke brought to you <laughs> by McDonald's. Oh yeah, that just reminded me that like I was in like a lecture, like at at the university, and the, like the the name like Ronald McDonald was brought up. And like during like one of the slides, and I was the day was I was like really tired. So I, like for like a solid minute, I thought for like no joke that it just said Ronaldo McNaldo, <laughs> and I just like sat there like yeah that's right. <laughs> Ronaldo McNaldo, that is my yeah. favorite person on anywhere. I'm a huge fan of his let's plays. Oh my lord, that's fucking amazing. And then, it's like, after I, like, realized, yeah, it is Ronald McDonald, and I was just, like, looking at the words, like, is that how it's supposed to be spelled? It's so weird. <laughs> There's nothing on the screen, my guy. Yeah, that's why I was so shocked. He thought it was gonna be a big deal after all this time we were waiting. Yeah, Marimon is, like, the only fucking character that actually has, like, a weird, like, 
kind of reasoning and like morals and like he doesn't know what he's doing and he's losing his he's mind. The one, he's the only one who's actually like doing anything. Yeah. Technically. Everyone else is like doing their own stuff, but like so everyone's like, things are bad, I'm gonna try to do something about it. Also, and then he does like the worst decision. I also like how if you go back, you can see that the red spiral that he shoots out doesn't actually cover the entirety of the screen. Like the lower left and upper left corner are actually still like uncolored. Mm -hmm. I was always those kids like, that's so stupid. This is the only way. So now we're fighting Maramon. One of probably my least used... And I'm only talking about this game, but in this game, this is probably my, one of my least favorite Digimon. Because it's just a man, you know? Yeah. yeah. He looks like it was... I thought at first it was, like, powering up. Because it, like, stood perfectly still as he's getting hit by it. <laughs> yeah, that actually does look like it would fit with him. What is Man, your... that moves a lot faster than I thought it would be. Oh, yeah, no. Flame, uh, fire Tower or whatever is fucking great. Um, What is your favorite Digimon in Digimon World 1? Honestly, I've had so fucking few of them that I don't really have like a good answer. Like, I always wanted to get Andromon. But and... never got there. Andromon is actually the only, and I'm not ashamed to admit this, even, I, I am, Andromon is the only fucking ultimate I've ever been able to get on my actual physical PAL copy of the game. That's, nice. that's it. And I don't even know how I got it. I, it must have been one of those extra, um, like, you know, extra, like, bonus condition things, because I'm pretty sure I did not get his stats up to where they were supposed to be. Also, good, <laughs> real lucky with that finish just being strong enough. I know, right? Miramon drops the oof chip. Yeah, uh, you're going to be finding a total of three offensive ships down here. <laughs> and I won't be able to gather any of them. Oh, because you didn't dump empty your items. Yeah, I also didn't bring a fucking autopilot. What are you here for? You're supposed to remind me of this shit. <laughs> hey, I was in the bathroom. Oh. That... You were in the bathroom when I was talking to Shellmon. You were with me when I went back to the fucking town to make Garurumon go to the bathroom. I don't want to hear his excuses. This is a two-part, this is a two-man Let's Play show. I'm only here to look at the screen. Accurate. Oh, God. Oh, I never know. Okay, so, in, so as the storyline of, like, the outside world, um, people how, how are... How many people? How many people are no, there? No, not more people, but like people walked outside and they're like, some, there are some shouting? I don't know. They do that a lot. Like, I guess these people like just fucking hate their apartment. Offense ship, another one. Oh, look, a second offense ship. Uh, you know what? Get out of here. I was about to say, that's so much money, but no, not really. Plus, we uh, can just make money. We're yeah, we can also it's... Print money. Also, it's not that great even, because it's only like, plus 50 for one combat. Yeah, it's not that... It's not Which is not a lot. I really dislike that in, um, Digimon World Cyber Sleuth. Like, you get... I have a ton of uh, boosts, like attack boost, speed boost, etc. But it lasts only for five turns, can only be used in one Digimon, and it doesn't tell you by how much it boosts it. But I would say it's probably like 10%, because that's what, uh... No, actually, th I think it does say 10%, which is not that much, so... I don't mm. know, I don't think those boost abilities are really that good. Yep. By the way, I thought of this the same time, like, when I played this game on my own end, when I was like, you got to the computer and got protection, I was like, we also made that joke. We 100% made that joke about, like, oh, you're just kind of... Definitely, dude, at the time, because that was, we like, were, the funniest. Because we were all... Because we were all dudes. At that time, dude, that was, like, the funniest shit you could have ever said. Protects your condition in battle. Why would I ever need that? None of us, we never prepare enough for that to be useful. Do we? Should I just throw it? Sure, it's not that expensive. Okay. I say, and I was going to turn out, oh yeah, it's cost a thousand. That's fine. We, we but can... again, money is not going to be an issue. No, it's not. Because we've already established how we can get a ton of it. Yeah, we're ne money. And I, I mean, it's kind of important because honestly, Digimon World, all of them, are already, by nature, kind of difficult and complex games. So the idea that you now also have to grind money is kind of stupid. Especially because in Digimon World 1, there's no easy way to get money. Like, outside of cheesing it. Yeah, you're supposed to just fight. Yeah, and... And the occasional minigame. And the fighting doesn't give consistent money. Like, there's one... Like, I... 
That was a part that I cut out of my canceled Digimon World playthrough, where um, um, uh-huh. like one red Vegemon gives you 500 bits. And I was like, oh shit, I can farm that for a lot of money. And then I went to the next screen where there's two red Vegemons, and they only give you 100 bits each. And I'm like, what the fuck? Why are you doing this? So it's so inconsistent. Cheapskates. Mm-hmm. What's up, Blazer? Why are you yelling at me? You still have like 30 minutes before you get fed. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the time we're going by. Yeah. Hey, it'll open yeah. soon. I'm pretty sure now we have to wait like a day before that opens. Uh, either that, or I think if you just get around to where the other end is, it will already be open. Maybe. I think. Well, now we can finally actually check it out. Yeah, we opened another path. How would you know that? Eh, you'll just see it once we'll, you get close to it. We'll go to the west side of the island. Finally, it only took us like three hours, three and a half hours. And there's a lot of stuff that like, I feel like this game is like very much like made in a way that like you're supposed to just randomly stumble upon stuff. Yeah. And, and there's um. Uh, to me, Digimon World 1 was like fairly unique for that to me because it's like a game that's like made for you to get lost in it and just like uh, and just be in this space for a long time since you get to like level up your Digimon stats and stuff like that. Yeah, no, I, uh, think, that that's, I think Digimon World is fucking awesome for that. And I thought it was like super unique for that, but like in the last like few years, I've like found games that like really do remind me a lot of Digimon World in that like a different part of the structures. Um, First of all, uh, there is, um, in terms of just RPGs, there's the romancing saga games, like 2 and 3, spe- especially 2. Which... Where there's like a big element of like non-linearity and like events that you kind of just stumble up across. I just to play those, because when I, I saw the original ones, like the Game Boy ones on Switch, and I was like, eh, I'm not sure how I feel about those. And then I saw that there's mm-hmm. a fan translated J- Japanese-only uh, 3D remakes on the DS, and I was like, I'll probably play those. Yeah, I don't know nothing about those. Uh, but another game that like I'm also reminded of, which isn't even a full-on RPG, um, is Moon. Or Moon RPG Remix, like the anti-RPG game. What? Yeah, because that game's extremely entirely about... Um, the story's like that you're a kid. It's an isekai, basically. You're like a kid that like plays video games, and then so you're just in the video game world. Oh. And there's a and there's a hero that goes around and just kills monsters. Like no one likes him. He's a, he's, a, but he's supposed to be like a legendary hero. Hero, so people tolerate him. Do so you run around and like collect the souls of those monsters? And then you do like events for people because there's like a t- there's a clock that's going and like events happen different types of the game. And just the vibe of that game reminds me a lot of the vibe um, in Digital Modern World. That's interesting. I've never heard of that game before. Yeah. Well, um, it was Japan only. A Japan only PS1 game for a long time. And then it got translated and ported to the Switch. Oh. Yeah. Uh, the Which... people that made Moon were actually like X square people. Like they were... Uh, a lot of people actually left Square, like, right after the Super Nintendo, uh, was done. Um, you got a lot of developers like that, like Alpha Dreams, the people that made Mario and Luigi games. Oh, yeah. Um, are X Square. And then the people who made Moon was another team that were, like, X Square people. So I'm but... fairly certain those were, like, people who worked in Super Mario RPG. So it's not available right now. Yeah, okay, then that's later. We have to wait for another day. Ooh. Rare item. Big berry. Can't hold anymore. Well, hold on a second. Well, hold on That's... a second. Big berry. Do we... Do we drop the money? Yeah, we drop the money. The money. We have yeah. enough. We can make money. We, we, we shit money, basically. Big Didn't even pick it up. berry. What is what, it? What makes do you do? full and boosts weight. Oh, so it's a... So it's a food item. Yeah, that's really good. Hey, well, it's a big berry. What did you expect? <laughs> I don't know, like, there's an item that I got in my own playthrough that's relatively rare called a Sweet Nut here in the Gear Savannah, and that's a full heal item. Oh. So the Gear Savannah has, like, the fucking best music in the goddamn game. Yeah. Without question. It's, it's awesome. 
Unfortunately, something they've never fixed in any Digimon game is that every single time you switch screen, the fucking music restarts. Yeah, it's a new area, so you have to load that music. Really unfortunate. They never mm -hmm. fixed it. I knew there was a mushroom. I knew it. Is this where the card shop opens? Yes. I believe so. Yes, it is. Hey? It's a shop. Recycling and card shop. Oh, it's recycling. I'm a recycling shop. It's just a normal shop. That's your chance. Regular item. It is really just... Oh, and also a giant meat. Uh, okay, so I guess I have to go all the way out to go for the recycled item. I don't have anything to sell? Okay. Oh, it's specific items you have to sell. Okay. This is a Digimon that card. That part shop. I didn't know. What is a Digimon card? <laughs> you can't lose with them. Mm -hmm. This card's about me. You got a card of Sam. Look, it's my card. I never figured out the point of these cards. Like, are they purely collectible? Yes. Okay. You don't even get to Let's play with them. Let's buy some cards then. Hell yeah. Buy a pack of three? Of course, yeah. Uh, 500 bits for a pack. No telling what's inside. Of course. I'm actually real. This is a Gatsu mon that I don't have yet. What? This is a Nume mon that I don't have yet. Okay. Yeah, just telling you that you don't have the card yet. I'm actually really, really... I want to start... <laughs> yeah. Putting the controller down. Audience, you're part of this. Rolls. I don't know why I was about to call you Naruto, but I really was. <laughs> I don't know. I guess because there's an R and there should be an N in your name. So I went with Naruto. <laughs> Rolls. Yeah. So... I was just about to tell you that I've been really, because I've been so in a Digimon mood, I was amazed when I saw the new Digimon card game that was just released. Yeah. And I was like, I really wanted to buy and like, um, buy like a deck and like get into the card game. And I was like, I don't know, but it's really odd to like, just go into like stores and play with people that you don't know. And I was like, world, how about we both buy some cards and do some- And then never- Meet up and never play. The deuce. No, 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 because no. actually I thought about this, and it's not really that stupid. It's kind of stupid, but it's not that stupid. Um, they currently have tournaments going on and qualifiers, and literally the way they're doing it because of COVID is they're doing it over Discord with webcams. <laughs> so, like, the official okay. licensed Bandai Namco Digimon TCG tournament is being held by people pointing their webcams at their playmats. <laughs> And I was like, Ooh, you and I could buy a deck and play it. <laughs> and then upload that to fucking YouTube. <laughs> no. Um, I think I own some really old Digimon cards somewhere. I'm pretty sure I got it in like a fucking McDonald's meal or something. Jesus, I never owned one of the originals, but I definitely want to fucking buy the new ones and play some of that. But I don't know how to do that. Whatever. Okay, so back to the game. Back to the cards. This is a Nami... Nanimon? Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. A Nanimon card. A Numimon card. Oh, so I just keep getting the shitty cards. Okay. You got two Numimon cards. Thankfully, you can sell them, but not for nearly the same value. A Vegemon, a Yanmamon, a Gatsumon. I keep getting the shitty ones. <sighs> Vegemon. Demi Marimon. Okay. Sukamon. Okay. Oh, God. We need to... We need to play the Digimon card game on... On uh, PlayStation. <laughs> Pixiemon card. Pay there is one. Yeah, no, what, what, excuse me, you didn't know about that? It's, like, awesome. No. Okay, we're playing that. <laughs> so we got the Pixie Mon card. Mm -hmm. and oh, Jesus, he looks derpy. Oh, my God. I didn't know they had mouths. What if they have people mouths? I don't know, they're really weird. I don't like it. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a good image, though. But what the fuck? Oh, he doesn't like it. Dude, cards have never been... Card art has never been, like, fully logical. Or even, like, stylistically consistent across them. <laughs> He's like, look at all this rock. <laughs> oh my god, I like hearts too much. He's like, looking at this, like, imagine if your walls was covered with flesh. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, because that, those walls are made of the same stuff as him. So yeah. He's like, how would you think if your walls were covered with your flesh? That's fucked up. Plus, I like how in this game, 
you can't have a duplicate. Like, there's Psychmons, the different colored Gobblemons. Mm -hmm. But you can only have a Gobblemon. And then in future mm -hmm. games, like Cyber Sleuth and Next Order, you can have Gobblemon, you can have Psychmon, you have Gobblemon Black, Gobblemon slightly mm -hmm. grayer. <laughs> Uh, I always liked how Elecmon looked. Uh, be careful, you can die here. Can you? I think so. I believe so. Well, I... Alright, I'll help you. You're gonna be somebody. Like, what is this? You run into him, get shocked three times, he's like, You're gonna be somebody one day. I'm gonna leave you now. Go to the <laughs> city. So, is that like you telling me slightly you would like an Elecmon? Because I don't think I've ever had one. So they can go for one. I've had one once. Uh, another Digimon I always liked, but I never got was Betamon. Oh, oh, dude, I was literally about to say after you were done that Betamon and then the two Cedramons are literally my favorite Digimon in Digimon World 1. Like, I love Betamon. It's my f probably yeah. used to be my favorite, so, like, yeah. entirely love that shit. Yeah. So we should get Betamon, yeah. yeah. I think there's a toilet here to the right somewhere. Yes, 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 it is. Right here. Oh, there it is. We're also gonna go get we should get the fishing the fishing rod while we can. Not finding Potamon. <sighs> He's stupid. You know that that fight that like scared me as a kid? Why did it well, scare you? Well not scared me, but that not scare me, but like stressed me out. That's fair. It's very stressful. Um I'm gonna remove You'll Winter find Blast. out why you're Winter Blast. Uh yeah, sure. And then Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Come on, Petermon. Just, just fire. Yeah, I'm an ice Digimon that only not only uses fire moves. Mm. I'm going yeah. against the grain like that. Yeah. So watching the anime, you're like, oh yeah, Petermon, he's gonna be weak. Right? Mm. And then he just has like fairly strong attacks. Yeah. He has really good attacks. Wish I could fucking learn any of them. But you don't have air type. You have, don't have any air type moves. Luckily, magma bomb. Literally, it just can carry you through the game. The only reason why I don't use it early game is due to the fact that it costs so much MP. But now, I think honestly, we can just keep using it. Yeah. And we have the infinite money, so we can basically just buy all the MP that we want. Mhm. Mm Talk about bits. Hell yeah. Now he gets upset. Let's do it again. Okay. Yep. Let's do it again. So, yeah, you have to like repeat fight this guy. You have to fight um, this guy in total three times. Yeah. But can you cancel and then come back? No. Okay, it does not carry over. Because I don't think I've ever tried that. No, there's... you... I'm pretty sure you have to restart from scratch if you try to leave. Fun fact, since you've never played it, uh, Next Order has a callback to this. Oh, really? There That's is neat. there is a set of there's a duo of Digimon that you have to fight three times every time you meet them and it's ridiculously hard. I'd imagine. Come on, one more time. Okay. Time for another ass kicking. Yeah, he really doesn't have a chance against uh, our leveled up Gurumon. What if we just died? <laughs> like he has three hearts just like we did. I would be- Oh, Jesus! I'd be very depressed, actually. Like, I'm down with smacking his ass, but I'm not down with killing this cute little critter. I also think I've never had a fucking Patamon in this game. Like, I have very much limited myself as a kid to, like, Agumon, Gabumon, and, uh, Betamon. Everything else well, is I kind never... of just an accident. Well, whenever you, like, get a new egg, the egg's, like, random, and then you're locked to, like, two stars. The egg's only random if your Digimon dies. Like if you like if you die through combat, if you just if it has a normal life, then you can choose the egg. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, never mind. It was random to me because I never knew what came out of which egg. <laughs> That's fair. It might as well have been random. It would have been easier actually. Yeah, sometimes I think about that. Sometimes I'm like, I really wish it was random. Because otherwise I always go back to the same Digimons that I enjoy. I have some giant meat, my boy. I was about to say, you weren't going to give him the big berry. The big berry. Um, we should actually say the berry for like... When we need the wait. Get the, yeah, we need the wait for like the next generation. Alright, now there's this stupid stuff. Yeah. So, I heard... And I'm not sure if I got this right. But I've heard that it's possible to soft block this part. 
So yeah. <laughs> so because I think there's a possibility if you when you wait in this corner, Biomon will run somewhere and she won't stop properly. Let's just keep doing that corner and like see if it happens. <laughs> Get rid of her, you just eat her. <laughs> Get the girl. You can just keep being in the same area, and it's eventually she'll most likely get there. Okay, we can try that. Mm -hmm. By the way, like, until last time I played this game, every other time she, I always got Biomon on the first try. So, like, I didn't know that she could run other places. I... But then I... Mm, I only got it right on the first time the last time I played it. Never... Oh, okay. Never before. And it was really mm -hmm. weird, because I always hated this part. The Digimon kidnappers. I mean, <laughs> I that's think... Like, yes? That's like an actually like kind of neat little piece of dialogue. The fact that like words coming around is going around around you or like about you. Yeah. But like they're not getting the details right. They're like, ah, oh, shit, like Digimon disappearing after this kid is showing up. And it's like, no, they're just going to the city that you guys are not going to. They're not disappearing. He's a Digi-napper. You, Sabina. He sleeps. I, w I had a really hard time for a second to figure out which of these blobs on the screen was me. Alright, now we go to the worst part in all of Digimon World. This hallway? Yep. I fucking hate this hallway. Garamani. Yeah, because this guy has like, you're like, oh, he looks like the fucking baby loser. He can't be too bad. And then you like hit him once. And then you see... That magma bomb. He has yes, a lot of HP. <laughs> Luckily, he doesn't do that much damage, and I have magma bomb to, to like shred him. But still, it's obnoxious. <laughs> Actually, going to explode in the fire explosions. Like, oh no, that gas! <laughs> <sighs> fucking hate this shit so much. And this is like one of the few areas where you can't avoid combat, really. Like, I like literally spammed save states one time to try to get through this without combat, and it's like f almost impossible. Yeah, it's real rough. Because it's such a like tight hallway. Yeah, you have to like wait for the, for the fucking millisecond that he moves. You, then you have to back up and then run around him, and I'm like, you can't. Because he also has a stretchy hitbox. Mm -hmm. Can't hold anymore. No, Psychmon is not the problem. I can avoid mm -hmm. Psychmon, but here the issue is I don't want to get double teamed here. Alright, there we go. Mm -hmm. And now let's recruit Sukurman. What do you mean to recruit Sukurman? I didn't know there's one of the Digimon rolls. This is in this is an actual dialogue line in this game. Oh my goodness! <laughs> we suddenly became British. <laughs> I'm Sukumon. I'm mutant Digimon. You're not poop. We shouldn't be prejudiced. Yeah, they're data dumps. They dumped the data. They're trash files. <laughs> Why isn't Pokemon as why isn't Digimon as popular as Pokemon? Well, Pokemon doesn't have, like, a fucking shit Pokemon. <laughs> Are you sure about that? I'm pretty sure that Pokemon has more than enough shitty Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, they have a trash Pokemon, and they have, like, a... And they have, like, a um, ice cream Pokemon. I guess, I bet if those two combined, they'd get this guy. Okay, so now that is that is basically... Yeah, he visits. I had him visit my time one day, I talked to him, and nothing happened. Basically, yeah. So See, you just have to, like, keep talking to him, and then he, like, when he visits? No, he doesn't do anything. <laughs> just, like, at all. He just stands there. Oh! Okay. That's why he's not really a recruiting th Oh, f ah. No! Nice jukes! Oh, thankfully, he, like, pushed it out. Mm. 
I hate Garamon so much. Like, who the fuck was like, we need a recolor of the shitty Digimon? Well, I mean, if you get him, there has to be a recolor. <laughs> or else he is cool. I don't like Garamon just sitting there, so I'm yelling in his ear. I think he's trying to be in a specific range before attacking, but he just can't. There you go. Just throw magma pies at him. Do it! I don't like how you refer to them as pies. <laughs> You're like <laughs> leaning into the shit theming. <laughs> the fucking drop a giant steaming pile of magma on him right now. <laughs> I will not allow my Digimon to produce anything but the, the most amazing a part. <laughs> a hot, wet piece of magma. Drop it on him. I'm taking a sip. I'm done with this shit. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Is magma wet? <laughs> I'm doing some, like, real, like, 2011 commentary right now. <laughs> let me... Is, let me go check is, real quick. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least 900 bits twice, that's pretty nice. I was about to say, yeah, that's like a big money. Why is that guy loaded? <laughs> Everything that happened there was cash. a little bit too much for me. <laughs> From you saying that is big money to you asking me why he's loaded and me thinking you meant why is he on screen still why didn't he despawn <laughs> but didn't he like fucking get deleted from the memory of the game yes why is he still here what a shit show <laughs> oh the, the the poopy jokes aren't going anywhere <laughs> yes they are because we left fuck you what does it say? Did it say sheep? Oh god, I see his mouth now. Yeah, you haven't seen, you never saw its mouth? I never noticed that he has just a gross mouth. He goes like, Neh. Yeah, he's a mouth boy. Mouth boys need love too. Hence why Yanmamon is never an option in any Digimon game. That is incorrect. It actually is a possible recruit in Digimon World 2. Okay. Digimon World 2 being the bad one. Being the most Pokemon like Digimon in all of existence. How so? Uh, you throw items at them, which help you catch them after you, after you weaken them. Okay. It is literally any Digimon, like, that. that's the only cool thing. Any Digimon you encounter in a dungeon, you can get that Digimon to join you. But, uh, you have to throw gifts at them. <laughs> and then you, Hey, be my friend! And then if you beat them last, if there's a group of enemies, you have a chance of them to join you. Okay. That's fun. Why am I... Well, no, you have no idea the fun part of that game is that it's not fun. Like, let me tell you about uh, your uh, DP and your ELs. Each Digimon has a level cap. Yeah. And um, in order to increase your level cap, you have to DNA Digivolve. So what happens is, let's say you start with an Agumon, because everybody loves Agumon, and then you get him to level 16, and he can't keep a, keep leveling up. That's his max level. Now you need to find another Digimon that you, uh, whatever, have leveled, and then you DNA Digivolve, which means they both combine into one Digimon. They're both lost forever. And who, what Digimon you get out of the evolution is up to a... Uh, table up so some kind of weird chemistry table so mm -hmm. you probably won't get your Agumon back but now the Digimon that you got is level one and it has a DP of one because DNA Digivolve what is a DP the DP decides what Digimon you Digimon will Digivolve into and the max DP or so I think is like 20 so oh every the game is grindy as all hell also, I just learned something new. I didn't realize this guy didn't spawn every time. Yeah, no, this is usually, he usually spawns every single time the first time. I was actually confused. Yeah. All right. I was like, oh, it's the next screen. Why aren't you going ahead to the next screen? I'm not sure if he can beat this. What do you mean? He's weak. All right. 
All right. All right, guys, get ready. Get ready for that uh, one heart loss. That gets me so mad that Roll just told me he's weak. <laughs> Wait, have you lost him? No, but... Oh, he's weak. <laughs> <laughs> I was expecting him to be... Because he has, he has that. He was about to use Water Blip, and that attack is ass. So... <laughs> Like, I can... might have lost to this guy myself in one of my playthroughs. Okay, yeah, that but was really easy. But I know he's weak. Yeah, he's pretty weak. You are correct. Oh, he's, he's ruffling. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite Digimon stage, ruffling. <laughs> they are nice. Rufflings Digivolve into champs. <laughs> I don't want to see where this is going, alright? <laughs> I've seen enough tubos wrapped around frogs to know where this is going. It is. So, like, I get the pun, because, like, the fact that, like, the Japanese word for, like, uh, what do you call again? Tadpole and note, like, Otoma, is, like, the same. So then you're like, oh yeah, because, so if like one of them's note, it would make sense that like the fucking frog they go into, evolve into, go into, evolve into would also like play instruments. But I'm not sure why they result, why they came up with the solution of being like, oh yeah, tuba. See, I didn't even know about that gag, so to me it was just weird frogs that are musically inclined. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, that's why you, there's like a music composing minigame in Super Mario RPG in like the tadpole like. I need to play those games. If I ever do sit down to play Nintendo-based to turn, like, JRPGs, you are going to fucking suffer with me. Oh, no. <laughs> it would have been really funny if that was just, like, bullshit. If that, that spell didn't actually do anything. That's what I used to think as a kid, because I never understood, like, that it actually, like, you can't go without it. I never understood what that was because I didn't know how to read English. But you still don't know, as we know from this playthrough. No, my brain's big now. Oh. Alright, so now we basically have opened up most of the islands. Yeah. So, finally, it, it took us a long-ass time to get started, but now we've made some real headway. Yeah. And we kind of delayed it by a fucking, like, at least an hour, because we didn't check in at the one spot at the earlier. I think that, that, that doesn't matter. It, it's fine. We, we've done it. We've... we've we... People can appreciate what we've done. Let's autopilot back to city because we need to yeah. uh, stock up on stuff before we go back out. And then we have a bunch of stuff to do. Yeah. But that'll have to wait until next time. See, I did that. See, I fucking did that. I'm fucking good like that. <laughs> Cats need feeding. Yeah, so the I need feeding. Thank you so much for watching. Mm. If you enjoyed this video, then please leave a like and a comment. If you're actually still here, if you're actually seeing this right now, are you okay? Do you need, do you need something? Like the joke's on us. We didn't make multiple videos. We only made the one. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> okay. Well, I'll see you guys when I see you, which is never because I don't do conventions. And uh, <laughs> Talling ninety five. I'm, I'm too good for that. <laughs> no, I don't do I, conventions. No, never. Not in a million years. Uh, and uh, Talling ninety five shall be back with me next time when we do Digimon World of the One and Only. There's never yeah. been another one. That one. They never made another world with that another world. Another game with the world Digimon. There was never another world. They never made another Digimon game with the word world in the title. There we go. Took me three times. That is a lot of W's in the sentence. Yeah. Alright, see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>